All right, let's extract insights from survey responses in Excel using Copilot. So this is a dashboard we built on the stream a while ago for NPS scores. So the data also includes comments in this case. Maybe we wanna extract some insights from those. This comes up all the time. It's very difficult to write formulas to extract insights from this type of thing. We're gonna to try to use Copilot to pull some of those out and just see how it works. I'm doing this for the first time right now, so let's, let's try it. So the instructions I gave it were make a pivot table that has all the entries in the comment column, but only ones with the classification label of promoter. That's just one of the labels we use in NPS scores. It analyzed it, it did extract all of the comments, and I believe I could just add to new sheet and it's gonna give us that. And hey, voila, there we go. It extracted all of them and added them in a new sheet and a new pivot table that looks to be set up exactly right. I say, you know, summarize the insights in this pivot table and see what it comes up with. It was having a little bit of trouble taking insights out of a pivot table. So I actually just copied these over and put them in a regular table. It was able to look at that and give me a summary of the core insights there. Could absolutely see the value of this if we had hundreds and hundreds of comments. Bottom line here is with survey data, especially anything that's just in the format of words, it's very hard to make dashboards and kind of build a report out of it that's easy and automated without you having to manually review a bunch of text. The cool thing about this is that using this technology, we could have a dashboard that's totally automated like this and then add a text field that is as simple as copy pasting out the insights we want after we've generated those pivot tables. So you have a summary of the core insights from the folks in each of these categories, right? makes it much more valuable and allows you to take it a little bit farther. I think we can't expect this to work the way that some other uh, LLM tools do because frankly, we don't want our Excel sheet just going off and doing whatever. There have to be a bunch of safety rails in place. So some of these systems can feel a little restrictive at times, but as they release new features and as we get more versions of this, I think it's just gonna get better and better and better. I'm pretty impressed with some of the workflows this applies to, especially with free form text in Excel. So. Go test it out. It's pretty cool. Let me know if you have any questions or you want me to test anything else. Bye for now, folks.